Here we go. We're starting at hole one. This is an old game for the Commodore. I'm playing it on the, uh, the Commodore Mini, and I have to use the keypad sometimes, so I've got it up over on the right-hand side, and I may hit the wrong key once in a while, so it may disappear, but I'll just bring it back up. So they kind of tell you the names of the holes. And this That's is this what that that burn, burn is the name of the hole. Uh, yeah, at least what it was back in nineteen eighty four or five, okay. whenever this came out. It was one of those so years. Swill can burn. So let's uh let's play. No, oh, there's that water, yeah. Oh, see, I didn't even know what some of these were. So let me hit the question mark. All right, here we go. St. Andrews, the old course. Two displays a legend of what? Okay, sound controlled hoggle. I don't know if there's much sound. Four is the scorecard. Putter man, that's the graphic down below. Club distance tables. Oh, five will give me my club distance. All right. I don't need to save. And so you got to punch in all these things to be able to see it. It's not just going to show not, it to you. No. So it's not like just hitting buttons. And a lot of the early games were like this. They were... You don't have a caddy to tell you. <laughs> they're kind of like... Uh, if you think of like... Uh, what was it? Monkey Basic or stuff. That the, Those things where you'd throw bananas and bombs and you have to hit the other person on the other side. And you'd say, oh, I want to throw it. And it, there'd be a wind direction. And then you say, I want to throw it at a 45 degree angle at a power of 40. Have you ever seen those games? Mm -hmm. Old basic games? I have no idea what you're So saying. the ball works kind of that way, except you're not trying to blow up the other guy. Okay. All right, so let's just X out of this. I think we're good. All right. So, the first we want to do is we want to. Um, Let's choose our our club. So I'm going to go C, and we're going to use our one wood, one wood. All right, and now I want. Was it direction? D. Yeah, that's how you're going to tell it. Enter direction. So, so straight across. So we got noon or. Twelve yeah. would be straight up. Three That's like, to the right. Six is down. It's like somewhere nine after ten. So we want 11. nine. No, probably like nine thirty, ten. It's only a little bit up. Let, let's do let's do nine forty five. Well, is it is it in relation to the screen as a whole, or is it in relation to where the ball is? The ball, and and it's always wherever the ball is. You okay, still got so, up down. Yeah, so if I draw a straight line. So a straight yeah. line would be nine. So yeah, somewhere around ten o'clock. Oh, no, let's okay. Let's try ten. So let's go with uh, one. Jesus, you gotta go zero, find the zero. colon. No, oh, no, this is zero. E boy. That's ten o'clock. That's ten, eleven. 12. I guess it is. There's not a lot of numbers, so I guess it is. Let's let's uh hit any key. All right, let's change that to 930. Yeah. So we want to hit distance again. Direction. And direction. And we're going to go 0, 9. Let's make it 915. Nope, it's going to be 930. All right, let's try it one more time. 0, 9, 30. Okay, that's pretty close. Mm-hmm. How do you know which way the wind's blowing? Um, all right. So now it shows, see the wind down below? It's pointing straight up, I think. Is that the wind or is the wind? Yeah, it must be the wind. Yeah, but it doesn't tell you how much wind. So even though we're hitting a little low, the wind should blow it up. All right, so let's go with our force. Yep. Well, let's try it. What, what does range do? Let's try that. Range, enter range in yards. 
So let's say we want to go 300 yards from the ball at that angle. 300. Um, enter. Oh, so from the ball, look at that. It gives you a nice sphere mm -hmm. of, of range. All right. So I don't know if we hit it 300, but if we do, we should be right in that little nook up there. Yeah. But see, you, you can tell it's actually the course because I've played it enough <laughs> this this last week. I, if anyone wants to watch them, I've been playing uh, the uh, St. Andrews courses because we've got the 150th anniversary of the Open happening in Scotland. So they're playing it at St. Andrews on the old course, or the British Open, if we ha we have to call it that, because over there it's just the Open. So event uh, evidently it's the oldest course in existence or known to man, and they're going to be playing there again this year. So that is exactly what it looks like, where several times, if you see me play other games right now, I've driven it in the water, that little creek that goes around. So... Okay, hit any key. Why do we... Any key just goes back to... Uh... Okay, it just clears everything. Yep. So now we want our force. And just in case this club hits... No, we're going to go full. Yeah, I was going to say, you only have a couple of options, so... Yeah, what's nice about force, F, and full is it's the same button. And now I just hit the ball... I hit the one key to... Create my stroke, right? Yep. Oops, looks like you sliced it. Why did I slice it? Is it going to hang on, though? It might hang on. So I guess just that's a random thing that happens, uh, which probably means it's going to go in the water. Go past it. Or you're going to be out of bounds. Hit any key. I cannot not hit the water. I guess not. Why did it slice? I don't know. All right, so there's a penalty. Well, at least we got to see what happened. So it gives me a drop. Your shot was 248. Hit any key. All right, so it gives me a drop there. So let's look up. six yards. Let's look up. That's how much is left, right? Yeah. So, um... What did it say? Was it five that tells me my clubs? Five will give you the club table, yeah. All right, the club table. So let's hit five. All right. So we got to go, how many yards was it? One, 106. My caddy. So 106. So 106. So we want to go with a... Uh, now here's the tricky part. We want to make sure that we can do like a three-quarter. So this shows you it looks like the quarters and everything. So is there a 106 in there? It looks like a five iron, five iron at three quarters, right? Yeah, it's one hundred four. So let's use a five at three quarter. Okay. All right. All right. So club five iron. Uh, the five and an I mm -hmm. iron. All right. So our force. Our force is so it's probably just the first letter of any of these so let's put t all right five iron at three quarters and we need that looks like we should hit it right at nine right straight across like nine yeah 905 now the the key is is if it is it going to carry that water again so let's do nine did you put D first? Oops, no, 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 no. I'm sure if we had a keyboard, this would work much quicker And yeah. if you started playing this a lot. So what I say? 9, nine. Oh, 5. Hey, that's pretty close. And the wind is still blowing up. So. All right. Well, let's, let's give it a shot. So the one button? Yep. See, it's nice. So that side view shows your ball in the air, so you know it's not coming down yet. So we're over the water here. We're starting to come down, and we're not going to make it. We're going to go right in. Stay, 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 stay. Son of a... Oh! 
Did it carry? It looks like it the carried. The length of the shot was 98 yards. Hit any key. Oh, my goodness. It carried just barely. Okay, we didn't get a penalty. Okay. Your slope is down and to the right. So we got 30 feet. 39 feet. So we're hitting right into it. Let's see what... Uh... But the slope's coming back at you. That's okay. That's okay. So let's... um. You want to look at your club thing again? Yeah, we should look at the... Well, let's just set up our... our uh direction first and let's try 10 at that one right there okay okay that'll give us an idea if we need to adjust all right so maybe 10 40 see what's what's great is it's showing like buildings and stuff in like a 3d side view that we don't see yet mm. and you see how it shows the green starts right there you see how we're yeah. on the fairway and you see the green that's that's pretty impressive when you hit that building I mean, if, the, if they would have just made this three-click, which wasn't... I don't think it was invented yet. No one did it. So let's go with direction again. Mm -hmm. I think it was more than 10... Uh, 30. It's probably like 1040, right? 1040. And the wind's blowing a little bit, all right? Let's the just give... Yeah, the wind's blowing up, but the okay. whole thing's rolling back at you. All right, let's give this a shot. Just for just for the sake of it, and we've got thirty nine feet. So when we use, we'll go to our club, and we're going to use a. Uh, let's use that extra wedge. Extra wedge. All right. We're not carrying an extra wedge. Oh, I guess I told you I didn't have one. So let's use a sand wedge. All right, sandwich. Mm -hmm. How, how now, much force? Right. Let's look at our club chart, which is the number five. Yeah. So we want to go thirty-nine feet. Oh, and I think this uses force anyway. So sandwich. Oh, see, it's up to feet anyway. See how it uses feet this time? Yeah. All right. So go to force, and instead of quarters we enter the force in the amount of feet we want so we're going down slope a little bit let's say uh let's say we shoot 41 feet just a little extra okay 41 feet all right and let's swing with the one Okay. It went the whole way. That's probably more important for the putting after. So obviously we're going to be... The length went... 49, wow. Oh, the wind was blowing with us, wasn't it, kind of? Oh, yeah, it was still blowing I forgot about straight. that. I was thinking of the... All right, we'll get better. So we want the putter now. So let's go to our club. And let's go to the... PT, is it? So that gave me a putter. All right. So three o'clock would be straight across to the right. Mm -hmm. So three fifteen. Sounds about right. So direction zero three fifteen. Nope. What do you think? Twenty. Oh, well, hang on. The slope, the slope is, is going to bring away. it down a little bit too. You're right. Let's see how much slope affects it. Good thinking. So we now need to do our force. Mm -hmm. And because we're also the slope. Oh, no, look, the slope's going the opposite now where we are. It's going up. See it? Yeah. All right, let's change. No one the slope's doing that when we hit it. Let's, let's go 14 feet. You have to get out of your force. Oh, you, you're entering. That's the okay. Force. I'll, I'll enter it. that. And then I'll go back to um, direction. Yeah. To and we'll, change the time. What were we at? 315. It shows so you. So let's there. try three, because it's going to come back upwards when we hit the ball. Mm -hmm. So let's try 320. All right. Zero. 
three. Seven. Well, let's try that. We got our force already set, right? Yeah. Force at 14 and one. That is a cute little uh, animation there for just a few pixels. Ah, I see I should have gone under a bit. Four. And then I can hit one. This will tell me if I really need to really adjust below the holes and stuff like that. There we go. We're in. It takes as long as a real hole. Double bogey. But we learned a lot. And I did go in the water once. You did. All right. Par through hole one is four. I have a six. I am two over. The next hole. One through 19. Why does it say 19? Uh, we're going to get a beer at the end. Mm -hmm. All right, I'll take that advice. All right. I oh, wow. What? You're way over there on that little thing. Yeah. So what do we, th we, we did 10 o'clock last time. I think the direction is always the best way. I wish you could just go with the direction and just change the it. The wind is blowing straight up again. Okay. So let's go, let's start with 10 just to see where that's going to put us. That looks perfect, yeah, right? And the wind's blowing up, so that should help. Yeah, let's do that. And, um, but I could end up in that bunker. So let's go a little below. So we'll get quicker at if this. If you don't go into the forest, would it default to full? Uh, that letter's already pre there. You're, you're right. We should try that because I could be wasting time. Because it did say some stuff is defaulted, right? I don't know. I'm not wearing my glasses. We read. I didn't read Why is it going thing? so far left? What? Why did it? Why did it take off so far? It's not you giving. You hit me, a wall. Yeah, but it's not giving me very accurate. You know, with the wind and stuff, it seems like you could slice it or hook it any time. Yeah. All right. Well, we we're here. We didn't lose a shot or anything. It looks like we're still on the fairway a little bit. Or I'm just in the blue. It's hard to tell. Um, no, you did lose a shot. I did? Yeah. Well, I'm on shot what? Three. I did. What the heck? You said you hit a wall, so you went out of bounds. Okay. You're in rough. You're 164 yards away. No, wait a minute. Is You see what we're missing here? We thought that was the wind down below. Yeah. That's not the wind. Look, it's that big arrow right next to us. See how it's blowing down at an angle? Well, what's that wind an arrow below that? I, I don't know what that is. I don't know. So it's the big arrow. I thought that other arrow was just telling us this is where we input stuff. Now, now we got it. You're a horrible caddy. Couldn't even tell me the wind direction. People can't see that look. <laughs> <laughs> they could probably feel it, but all right. So what, what what should I do now? What do you think? Oh, do not ask me after that, smart ass. <laughs> Four iron, and I don't want to try yet. I'll do it on the drive next time. Okay. Uh, force. force full. I can just hit that twice. So we're good, right? We just gotta hit it. We yep. said everything. if I'm in the rough as long as I get over this I don't know if that's water or not but I don't think it's water I think it was just just out, out of bounds, bounds area yeah. see it's coming down already we were not quite in the fairway so we weren't getting a full 100% that's okay we're out all right so how far are we now is that arrow longer if it's full maybe that's the three-quarter arrow it's stubbier let me go let me go to oh well, maybe no it didn't change Go back three quarters. There's nothing that shows like if that arrow was a different length. Oh, how about the little graphic of the guy? Look at his club. It's all the way up at the top now. 
full gotcha. swing. But and I still don't understand what the arrow is about. I don't yet either. I don't yet either. I mean, we can see the slope there. What's the other little graphic, too? What are the little graphics? The flag with the hole in the middle. Uh, no idea. And then that, something that looks like a speaker next that, to it. I think that is a speaker. I can turn off the sound. It's not very far, so the one's not going to take it too much. So let's go... Just go 11.30 then. It's not a huge... Wow. 11, yeah. 30. Yeah, they might move it that much. We got everything we need now, right? Yeah. We just hit one. Mm-hmm. I think we got it now. I think we know what we're doing. Still going up, 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 up. Oh, that's great. It even cuts into the other thing. It's looking good. Let's move into the left a little bit. Oh! Why is it still going? Did it reset me to three quarters or something? Not to three quarters? Wait, I said five iron. That must have been feet, not yards. It wasn't feet. I thought it was... I was thinking yards. I just walloped it <laughs> out of bounds. Son of a gun. <laughs> You think I wouldn't? I don't know how to play. <laughs> no. Out of bounds. But yeah, yeah, no kidding. After it's, all it's that, it's because it takes so much damn time to go get all these frigging keys. Oh, it's the back and forth with the it keys. It is the back and forth. Oh, it put you back where you were. Yeah. All right. So what did it say? I'm sorry. What did it's it say? It's 103 feet. 103 feet. So we want a sand wedge. <sighs> or a pitch. We can do a pitching wedge. Doesn't matter. All right, let's do it this way. I'm such a fool. Um, so club, what a fool. And pitching wedge. Again, a good caddy would have <laughs> said, what do you use a five iron for? You're only like 100 feet away. <laughs> I, I didn't even have a chance to read. I told you twice you were 103 <laughs> feet away. You, you did. Uh, I can edit key. this out, right? But no, I, I'm going to show this. This is gold. It, if you can imagine, look, it's, it's, it's moving it even more now. Look how much that wind's taking it. Yeah. That's quite an indicator to know that. Wow, and then it rolled. Oh my goodness. I'm hitting it that way, and I think the slope's going to carry it this way, so it should roll with it. Okay. So I'm going to hit force of 45 feet. Okay. Five feet. And we're going to swing this sucker. Line that putt up, yeah. Give it a, give it a good... Do a little squat. That's... Oh, come on! You couldn't give me that? Close, but no cigar. You better not miss this. <laughs> that it didn't even show it. Yeah. Why? Why, why is? Why is it the a, a bad sound when it actually did in? Try straight to avoid the bunkers. Right and left, short iron straight to the flag. You got it. You got it, champ. A short iron, so. No woods this time? Well, no, that's after. Oh. We got 355 yards, so we're going with the, uh, the club is going to be our one wood. Are you going to not set the force and see what happens? Yeah. Let's see if it gives us a full swing without having to... Fo force probably is always full, mm -hmm. but now we need a uh, an angle here. 10, 15... That looks better, right? Yeah. All right. We hit that, and we hit our one. Let's see if we can get one good hole out of this. So I was wrong. That, that time it said we slice. So it's going to randomly throw a slice or a hook once in a while, it sounds like. It's a random generated thing. Mm-hmm. And that time I thought I did something like that. It was just like we weren't reading the wind right. Probably. 
10, 15, no, 10, what we had? Yeah, 10, 15. Let's yeah. see what 10, 15 looks like again. Yeah, this looks good. Yeah, and then the wind's going to be blowing against you. So. so we should be able to just hit one now, right? Logically. I think we did everything. Now, I can see once you've learned how to play this, it might be pretty fun once you've learned to, oh boy, it really the wind really takes it on those those irons. You're gonna have to really overplay the wind with irons. And it's gonna roll a mile away. You want it to come in above the hole? Yeah. So 130, let's see what that looks like. That looks, I mean, it sounds right. That looks really good. Let's just go with that and see how we do. Okay. I think sure we, you hit it hard enough. We got everything set. Well, I set it for 117, uh, 125 feet. Okay. You think it needs to be hit harder? No. We'll see how much that slope affects it. Because mm. it could be like the wind. It could be on short stuff like this. It's really going to bend it. Yeah, see, it is. It's really impacting it. Not as much as I thought. Hmm. Okay. That was pretty good. Mm -hmm. So let's do eleven. Because it's gonna it's gonna bring it down a little bit. Okay. Force. Eleven. Boom. One. This hole's already taken less time, right? Mm-hmm. I should have went with the extra. Ah, come on. Oh, ball went in. Oh, good. All right. It didn't look like it went in. It didn't look, no, but it went in. Must have been some uh, explosions there. They were trying to blow up some, some gophers. <laughs> drive left of center or right of center. Okay, don't drive down the center. Ginger beer. Ginger beer. I used to serve that at the Common Ground Fair. Really? Mm-hmm. You served it? No, they... Or they I was they, like... They, there were places that you could get it. All right. Eee, boy. It was, it was somewhere between root beer and ginger ale. It wasn't like All beer, right. beer. I'm going to look at the radius real quick. Or not the radius, the uh, range. range. Nine, fifty-five. There we go. That looks good. We got it. Mm -hmm. And we hit, right? Yep. Yeah. Well, I don't know why I'm so worried about it. I'm really trying to get to the meaty part of this other part. I'm not hitting it at the hole. I was overthinking it. We're not even getting that far. We had all that area. Oh, in the that's center. why you did the thing. But I thought you were just trying to make sure you stayed out of that bunker. Well, it's nice to keep Which us in. Doesn't oh, look like you'll do. But no, no, it's, it's good. It definitely blew it down the wind huh? quite a mm -hmm. bit. I don't want to miss the green though. Because we could overshoot it with this. Yeah. Let's let's ten, twenty. Let's just do ten, just a little extra. I want it to be able to drop in and get yeah. that angle, you know, so we don't go over those little extra spots. Yeah. All right. So we're all set to hit, right? Yes. All right. Here we go. Everybody, quiet. Doesn't look like it's gonna make it. It's going so slow, huh? Hmm. All right, still going up. That's good. All right, start dropping. There it comes down. It's looking good, huh? A little low. You're right. We could have gone 10, 25. All right. We're on the green. Yeah. This looks like a weird turtle or something right now. Or a, you see, yeah. it's like, oh, it's, yeah, it's like winking at us. A turtle. Huh. It's a dinosaur winking at us. All right, how far away are you? All right. 95 feet. The slope is going, going with, with us. us. Let's give it a go. My first instinct is that it's probably had to be a little more below the hole. Yeah, it's already jumping every few. Oh, it straightened out a bit. 
go, 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 drop, 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 drop. It really didn't drop much, but the distance was good. Force. Um, I'm going to go the full seven because it's not very far. And hopefully that powers it right into the hole without having too much of the slope take effect. We're just so close to it, it, it it's... No, it went below, see? I should have gone way above it. Force. Three. I hope it doesn't go under again. I mean, we're only three feet away. I probably should have hit it at like four. The ball looked the exact same as it did before you hit it, after Bit. you hit it. Hole across. Lots of bunkers, huh? This is a par five. Yeah. All right, let's just wail on it. Which is good, because that'll keep it below those bunkers. Because the ball will come down a bit. It's, it's a long, long hole. Like I say, you can hardly get anywhere. Why is it going up? I don't know. That's not a good sign. Why is it going up? Bunker? The sand trap. Okay. At least I'm in the bunker. Sheesh. Why not? And it was full, right? Mm -hmm. So let's see. I, I'm hoping it'll take some off it hitting out of the sand. And it did. It's already dropping. Did it roll off the green? Yeah. That's shitty. A little more than 1030, yeah. Mm. Direction. If the wind picks it at all, yeah. 10. 40. Let's see what we get. Why the wind really takes it though. So the the, the the distance you get is the carry in the air, it looks like. So we're gonna have to calculate that because that was the air. And then it rolls out. All right, 58 feet. The slope's going with us. Mm -hmm. All right, so let's go force. I'm just going to do 55. Slope's going with us. Uh, direction. I'm going to say 255. That looks good, doesn't it? Mm-hmm. And that's it, right? I, I just think hit so. It. I mean, that went right over the hole. I didn't go far enough. Mm -hmm. You said to hit it 55 feet? It went 54? Yeah. It went past it. Went around it. Just so I get a little angle on it. That little bent means it went in. Yeah. Oh boy. Okay. This is tedious. It's Having tedious. Having to type all that stuff in well, all the time. It, right. With a keyboard, a real keyboard, you'd be typing this stuff in pretty quick. No. I don't type. I well. mean, because I could hit direction da 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 real quick, and it's all numbers. 
don't know. Something doesn't seem right about the calculations to me. They are Somewhere. a little. They are a little maybe off because I don't like the way it draws the line from where your dot is, especially when you're right next to the hole. I guess for the era. There was already the hole in one game for the MSX, and there was already golf on Nintendo on the NES. So the three click stuff did exist already. This is more of a what I would call simulation, if you want to think of it that way. Like, this is, this is really more of being the caddy than anything. Mm. Because you are telling the guy playing exactly what to hit, what angles and everything. So this is more of a caddy-style game. Yeah, but and, the whole, like, constant retyping in a, a number from a clock. Right. Oh, good lord. But, I mean, that's... Not bad, because I've seen other... I'd have, I'd have to be either desperately bored to play a computer game or love golf more than life itself to well, put up with this on a regular basis. They've had other ones that do, like, the 360. So, and I think that would be easier, because then you're only, you know, dealing with three numbers all the time. You're not having to put zero well, in front. It doesn't have to be easy. It just has to be enjoyable. Well, yeah, but you're not thinking of the, the, the nerdy people that were sitting at home no, I was playing my TRS-80, okay, with the little cartridges and my little video games. So. Yeah, well, that took us forever to get through five holes. It did. It's dark out now. Yes. 